So let's begin practicing the melodic minor scales. The ones that I've called group A are actually the same as the group C major scales from the major scale handout. And the reason that I wanted to start with these scales versus putting them as the last ones we'd look at are because they have exactly the same fingerings as their major scale counterparts in both the right and left hands, and they're the same exact scales in a group that were in group C before and all of them have exactly the same right hand and left hand fingerings. So rather than worrying about fingerings to start with, I want you thinking about the pitches, which of course with melodic minor differ when you're going up versus you're going down. So beginning with E minor, we take the same fingering that's for E major and for all of these scales in group A here. Lowering the third scale degree, we're not having a major third, but a minor third. Thumb comes under, and now the top part of the scale moving up through melodic minor is exactly the same as major. So going up a melodic minor scale is exactly like the major except you lower the third scale degree. Now on the way down, we lower the seventh and sixth scale degrees making T and La, Te and Le. Keep the minor third, same fingering as we've learned. like that. So the left hand version, again, same fingering as its major scale counterpart and same as all the other ones in this group A category. Five, four, three, two, one. La, Ti, Do. La, Ti, Do. Lowered La and Ti to Te and La. A minor, same exact deal, same fingering as its major scale counterpart, same fingering as all the other right hand scales in this group A. La, T. Te, Le. Now this part of the scale is going to confuse some of you because we're descending down through A melodic minor, all white keys. So you have to remember where you are in the scale. All right, so we, we ended up here. Third finger comes over, fourth finger now to allow us to bring third finger onto the C as we did in the octave above and end on thumb. All right, so that's a bit tricky. All white keys, no black key to white key transitions to orient yourself. The left hand. Four, three. Here's the coming down now, all white keys. So you have to remember one, two, three, thumb under for the E. Thumb under for the A, again, thumb for the E, and that one, you commonly forget that. Okay, D minor gets a little bit easier because it has some more black and white keys to give ourselves uh, some uh, idea where we are. One, two, three, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five. Bring it down, Te, Le. Same finger as the others. La, T. La, T, Do, Te, Le. Cross under. Black to white. Right. G minor. Same exact deal. Do, Re, Me. And again, same as the others. And then lastly, we have C melodic minor. So make sure you practice the group A scales, melodic minor, running up and down just like I've shown you, but also practice chording them. Now when you chord them, I want you to chord all three forms. So when I ask you to chord melodic minor, what I'm basically going to be asking you to do is to do the ascending version. So for C, that looks like this, right, with the La and T in it. Now when I ask for natural minor, you're going to take La and T and lower them both a half step. 
to Te and Le. Remember, natural minor and the descending form of melodic minor are exactly the same. So that's why I'm going to say melodic minor and I mean the ascending version. Natural minor will be that, same as descending melodic minor. And then of course harmonic is sort of combines the two. Lay from natural and T from melodic. So make sure you practice chording all three forms in addition to running up and down the melodic minor form.